Good morning. Here are the headlines for today. Digital bond holders agree to further markdown debt. Future skills AI on the agenda for Amcham Trinidad and Tobago Tech Summit. CIBC First Caribbean Cayman discontinuing over the counter transactions. Bond holders in Digicel's holding company have reportedly agreed to mark down part of their debt, but the threat of Chapter 15 bankruptcy protection looms as the group continues talks on a wider restructuring. Bond holders of US $438 million in Digicel have agreed to accept an initial US $163.5 million. However, the group will retain rights over certain distributions from the proceeds of the sale of other remaining assets. The group has accepted an initial U.S. 19.5 million cash payment for U.S. 215 million of so-called senior payment in kind notes, but also continues to hold rights to potential certain future distributions from asset sales. Meanwhile, Digicel continues to engage in negotiations for the restructuring transaction to reduce the company's indebtedness by approximately U.S. 1.8 billion. To read more on this article, go to our dot today. The Tech Hub Island Summit 2023 with the theme Catapult, which has been scheduled to hold from June 29th to the 30th, will bring together startups, multinationals, government agencies, investors, and tech enthusiasts. Catapult, this year's theme, acknowledges that TNT can learn from others ahead digitally. Among the issues to be discussed are artificial intelligence, cybersecurity, and digital financial inclusion. Acham TNT CEO Nira Tewari said the event is geared towards anyone interested in the role of technology in business. Republic Bank is the official title sponsor of the event alongside other organizations like PwC, Mastercard, Digital Business, Exim Bank, IDB, and the Trinidad and Tobago Financial Center, amongst others. For more information about the summit, visit www.techislands.net. To read more on this article, go to tt.loopnews.com. CIBC First Caribbean Cayman has notified customers in a series of phone alerts that effective July 3rd, 2023, the bank will only process over-the-counter OTC transactions on an exceptional basis. CIBC First Caribbean advises that transactions such as cash and check deposits below KW 8200, amongst others, will not be facilitated in the branches and encourage the use of its alternative banking channels. Notwithstanding these changes, CIBC First Caribbean is acknowledging that there would be instances where clients may be unable to access their alternative channels. As such, the following exceptions would apply on a client-by-client -client basis, senior clients, corporate and private banking clients, and clients unable to use alternative challenges due to accessibility concerns, amongst others. To read more on this article, go to our dot today. This was your Caribbean Fest headline news to start your day. Bonjour.